Here I am. <laughs> Anyways, welcome everyone back to We Happy Few. Now we left off. I mean, I. Well, I mean, I'm still dressed up as a maid because what the hell not? Even though I mean, cross dressing is public publicly acceptable here. For every reason, yeah. Oh, I'm take your joy immediately. Look who's in the Don't make me come find you. I thought I was going to have to call a mummy. Go get the site, actually. Every now and then, oh. you hear someone talk about downers. What's a downer? Well, a downer is someone who simply isn't taking their joy. You, you, he's present. Indeed, the mental health of everyone around might bring them down. Huh. One thing is, I mean, if you're sprint, then that's the issue. Try to convince that his life is not happy, or even that your life is not happy. No, so you know what hurts, the, hurts the most? The moment you realize you're talking oh. to a downer, you should stop listening to him right away. He needs help. Listening to him won't help anyone. Yes, Are you happy with the conversation? I mean, that I, I was saying it was because I seem to know a bit of a. Or if none of them is a downer, they all seem as happy as can be. Well, 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 That regard, perish. Oh. That thing, perish. Got you. It's harder than killing Germans, isn't it? Nah. These people are really don't give a shit about them. So yeah, you know what? As the same Martin Python, bring out your dead. <laughs> Of your house, I mean, they're usually all loot and everything, so why even bother, right? I mean, I'm not saying that to myself, actually, and I don't even know that. Bummer. Perish! <laughs> Lucky strike. For God, for Harry, and St. George. Oh. Eh. <laughs> uh, a little old lady. Thick. Thick to the point where I even get slowed down on carrying her fat ass. And she's so tiny little too, she goes all flying. <laughs> uh, uh, well, I'm doing more so so, you know. I'm sending this time to fling another body out the window. Why is she letting the always fly? Oh, good God, no. Right. Not to like get a rainbow to cheer you up. Take his joy. <laughs> that's a that's a bummer. If I sprint and these guys are actually gonna try to kill me. Eh, how can I say? Gotta break into the laboratories now and get, you know, the scotch. Yes, some good scotch they have over there. Eh. Goody, no one saw that. Careful! You know how there's all that joy gas in there? It's going to make you throw up. You better wear a gas mask. You know what joy does to you. How about no? Catch me if you can. I'm the gingerbread man. Fuck me, shit. Ooh. Oh. Anyway. 
into another humbling village and still gotta keep out with the no gotta just got blend in with the normies. Yeah. And normies alright. Ah. Give me a moment. There we go. How's the family? We must catch up sometime. Indeed. On her face. Chop. Shit. I forgot. Keep calm. I'm here. Come on. You missed. All right. Oh, that okay. really takes it out of your shoulders. Keep on walking, and then they're what me and think worry about. Shagadelic, baby, you're switched on. You're smashing. Hmm. It's funny that uh, hmm. Obama. Once again, I don't even remember. Forgot about it. Yeah, I'm gonna have a lot of time to deal with tomorrow morning. I know I haven't uploaded quite a while. Yeah. <sighs> I'm really sorry about that. I have a lot of things in my ha at my hand right now that need a lot of attention from dear old me. And not much can do about it now, can I? What do you think is that thing doing the wrong Bobby Helmet, nice. Even a rubber cat suit, cause reasons. The fridge repair kits, and salt stuff. Unfortunately, I really, really don't need all this stuff now, do I? Get a bigger banger music box. Da 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 da. Eh. Make him a blue Molotov. Why not? Bigger banger because what the hell not, right? What else am I missing? There you go. I could do this in the dark. I think I have. I think I hear someone calling out what else. And hey. Yo, 
Yeah, I really wish we could pick up that thing, but whatever. Drop some stuff, laddie. Said I would drop some stuff, laddie. Not I drop some stuff. God hacking damn it. Good, see? Even way better than before. makes the heart grow fonder. Mm -hmm. There's been an absence of absence, I'm afraid. James! You don't have to air our dirty laundry to every stranger that passes by. If you do the wash, we wouldn't have some... Anyway, this is Ollie Starkey. Who's he when he's at home? We serve together at Ramsgate. Oh, Ramsgate. Sorry to intrude. Jealousy doesn't look good on you, Roger. You wouldn't happen to ken the whereabouts of Dr. Faraday? Not actually sure. She was always talking about making a portal in the universe. It sounds ridiculous, but, 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 but Roger says, well, we're a little worried she succeeded. Don't tell anyone. Or... If she has gone for good, we're out of work. I was sort of hoping... She designed the motoline pipes under the city, didn't she? Oh, yes. That was one of the first things she did on her own, after Mr. Faraday went on holiday. You're not going down into those tunnels, are you? It's like tangled hair down there. You know, like what's in the shower drain because certain people don't clean it. I was hoping there might be uh, blueprints. There must be, but the place is such a mess and she blew it up. The Bobbies won't even let us downstairs to water the plants. If Dr. F comes back and they're all dead, we'll never hear the end of it. Oh, that's too bad. Ollie. They want you to do it. Well then why didn't they... I could water them for you. Oh would you? We could try and dig up your plans while you do. Once again, the heroes of Ramsgate save the nation. That's true, and don't you forget about it, boy. Hmm. Flew into a rage. Yeah, things seem to be going pretty well for her. Punch the penguin. I kinda wish we could destroy all these things. Oh yeah, that's where the decontamination is. You take your joy in me. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. We'll make a gardener of you yet. <laughs> Bummer. Well, I mean, the vegetables aren't gonna have their own compost now, would they? Might as well just uh, provide some nutrition for the plants. We found your blueprints. Brilliant. Give us a look then. The thing is, we need someone to pollinate the flowers down there. Pollinate? Is your bum out the window? You can't expect a soldier to know about flowers, James. But we can't go down there, can we? It's my bee cannon. It's her bee cannon? Well, she made it for me. I thought you were worried about pollinating the plants. Alright, fine. 
Here's the bee cannon. You'll love it. It's got cannon in its name. What am I to do with that? Just find some bees, suck them up, go to the flowers, spit them out. I'll do my best. Bees. There's no bloody bees in the village. Ah, oh, damn it, it's back to the garden district, isn't it? Yep, it is. It's like your bee can whenever bees swarm. Or duck, brick, pile, blue malta, bigger banger, and rock. Nothing over here. Oh dear. Can I go over there? At least the map is working all right. Wait a moment. What? I mean, I can't. Oh, there we go. Because they're pressing the wrong one. Thanks to the gods, through pathways rough and muddy, a certain sign that making roads is not this people's study. Right. Your eyes beneath, eh? <laughs> well, lies beneath. Oh my god, that's so hilarious. <laughs> this is what I get for sitting out the war in a warm, dry office. Sundays, I just don't know what to do. Simon says. Ha <laughs> Yeah, I didn't say Simon says. It's flashing you all know the rules, don't you? Flashing, yeah. Flashing. I don't intend to do something. But if I don't do something. Chest. Fuck it. Probably be zombies in the way, I guess. I don't know. I'm just guessing. I used to love trains. I always wanted a train set. But I'm a girl. Who give a shit about that, hmm? I'd give her a train set if I could. How the hell does all this work? So that's not how you do it. I think you should stick to what you know.
Well, I guess we'll meet in hell. Right, then cross that <laughs> as well too, cause yeah. <laughs> Lay still, you bastard. The only ones around here clever enough to plan for winter, and now they're pretty much fucked. Or Father Nature. It's good this way, you know. That's another one that I've been to. Yeah. Oh, fuck it. I'm not shaking this thing, you know, mixing it a bit. Mix words or whatnot, but I don't know. You look how I feel, mate. Stay where I can see you. <laughs> Oh, for the 
part the center cannot hold. Oh, crime your river. You know what? Because why not? I'm gonna see murdering this shit. Oh. Now it's time to dare and endure. Will these hands never be clean? What happened to the gardens? I know what I should do. And I know what, will, what I will do. And of course, my old place all too, which, uh, well, the characters all believe they got actually bombarded by a bunch of thugs. I had nothing else better to do because they were different Democrats. <laughs> How can Jack live with himself after what he did to you? There's a nut, yeah. Train station and the honeybee nest over here. You know, the bees can actually reproduce and build their own nest while well, they're in there, right? It's an ill wind that blows nobody any good. I knew you once, didn't I? I'm tired, oh, I'm so very tired. Sick a night he takes the road in, as their poor sinner was abroad in. Well, the sun seems to be going down, so it's time for all good citizens to go home and go to bed. You don't want to go out at night, do you? That's creepy. Well, huh? interesting. Especially the fan sun and everything. But especially now, I have to. Watch out the difference, dude. I guess we wouldn't want to overdo it now, would we? A lot of bobbies around. A lot of bobbies. And to be honest, I'm not gonna lie, I mean... The histoplasma mushroom does makes everything look a whole lot better. Especially in the village world too, doesn't it? 
Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Are you really mad? Or is it just an excuse? Probably both. Why not? I'm probably just mad, and I'm probably just, I'm just an excuse to be myself. Isn't it? Anyway... <laughs> Didn't you think that was funny? Crickets. Bloody crickets. Maybe they found your blueprints by now. Not crickets, these are bees. Well, let's see how they respond in just a plasma. Shame's a plague inducing mushroom, but whatever. There's a tunnel, but it's, um, it's a bit dark. It's under the Uncle Jack fan club. They don't like you very much. Why? We have a sort of disagreement about whether Uncle Jack's a very fine, funny fellow or a rotten, murdering, collaborationist traitor. So that's why you smash all the televisions. Roger, manners. Have you got an escape plan for after you talk to the executive committee? Why would I need an escape plan? I'm just going to tell the executive committee what's going on in the village. They're not going to shoot the messenger, are they? Then I'll just go back to my... Home in the train station. How would I escape, anyway? Oh, I know. The parade float. It'd be ridiculous, Roger. What are you talking about? The Uncle Jack fan club. They bring a giant balloon to the Battle of Flowers parade every year. It's enormous. It's supposed to be his head. Well, that could carry you away to... Well, wherever the winds take you. I suppose if I'm in the club anyway, I might as well grab the float. If nothing else, no one will have to look at Jack's head floating across the village on May Day. You will need quite a lot of helium to fill it. Oh, I'll jump off that bridge when I get to it. Look, empty hydrogen tanks. What am I going to do with empty ones? The label, DSIR, the Department of Scientific and Industrial Research. What you know, in all quite labs. In the parade? You think we can get the deposit back? They must have full ones there. Oh, what did I ever do to deserve you, Margaret? All oh, right, I've got a map of the tunnel into the parade. Seems like I need to get in through the Jacobean Club. God, I hate Uncle Jack. It's funny, you know how uh, Margaret, you know, like uh, his vision of uh, of his dead daughter, but that's fucking creepy. Oh well, I'm gonna move on. Oh, the bees are dead already. Who would have thought? Anyways, we got twenty-one, twenty-one, yeah. Well, all in due time, right? All in due time. Hmm. I see. Sometimes, you know, studying college in English can be so tiring. That's important. Was I could carry a pack like this and not think twice about it. Hmm. Hmm. Now to find a way into the Jack Wellington yes, Club. Ten to twenty quarts of fluid a day from cholera. <laughs> 
Let this be a lesson to you then. Go forth and sin no more. Go forth and sin no more. Why the weapons always pick up on their life in like near death conditions? I guess I never knew. Guys, right as rain, right as rain. Yeah, see, well, there you fucking alien. You're too old to carry around so much stuff. Thank you, brain alien, for reminding me of the obvious. Well, another rifle. I hear an alien over here. I don't like the aliens. I want to kill the aliens. Because I've already been in here. If we'd fought, wouldn't they have just ruined the whole city? Like everywhere else? I don't need Barnet Fun. Are you fucking alien? I did. And you know what it's gonna do? I'll probably just one open. Yeah. And. Let's see if I step in. Next like jump! <gasps> Sorry, I had to see that. You know, pick up this his fat ass, and guess what? Since uh, it has his plasma, that's making man can full man control of me, making me speak in a very French accent, I shall ditch his body. He too thick. Never mind. I wonder how many times I've done this and forgotten. Mm. A little sauce around here. Single use, not didn't they? Oh, bloody me. Mm. Nothing like a nice, quiet walk to keep you from going mad, right, Margaret? <laughs> Shit up. 
other bastards. Jack Fanclub. I suppose they can't remember what he did during the war. What did he do? Voice of the Occupational Authority on the radio, wasn't he? You can't go in. It's a private club. Toffs and wankers only. Well, then who are you? I'm the fucking cook, ain't I? Don't look at me like that. A girl's got to eat. Look, why don't you just fuck off? You ain't got any honest business in here. From the looks of you, you ain't got any honest business anywhere. <sighs> Bunch of daft twats. I think you can go in. Trust me, I learned from the best. Get fucked and get fucked. What's that? What's that? Come out and take your medicine. Sure. That's it, you know, that's all to your medicine now, baby. Come out and place that will fuck you up. Educated men, we must be prepared to accept evidence that conflicts with our world view. However much we might wish to think. Yes, yes, you've been, been talking taking critical thinking and codes for quite a while. Tell us! Tell us! <laughs> I have discovered that Uncle Jack's hat is not red. It is blue. What? No! I conducted a careful analysis on my TV screen. And I suppose television sets have color now. Did you hear something? How do you get in? The <laughs> Oh, Lord. 
take your joy. Pokemon oh, getting hammered, you know. For God, for Harry, and St. George. We're the Piat. Yeah, that's all. Oh, Mushroom Pie, there we go. Did you hear that? Except you know the blood sugar really. We just want to make you feel better. Sorry, you had to see that. The heart has reasons which reason doesn't know, I suppose. Mm. I can think we're sure. Oh, how about the yeah, end? But hey. There could be a story. Ooh, it's chilly. Cleaver. I wonder if we're going to make it to this somewhat ish. Patience, Ollie. Just needed stirring. That's all. Yeah, patience, all right. And yet I just lit everything on fire. I like how the entire house is fireproof. We'll drop some stuff, laddie. Like this thing. I bet it's all up there. They don't need a cook. They need a maid. Where's the bloody parade balloon? About to happen. You could hide the Tsar and all his relations up here, and no one's the wiser. Hmm. Time to get the float out of here. Ollie! I said float. What did you think I said? We didn't come here for the float. We came here to get into the Motoline tunnels. Ooh, that's right. How did he gang out of here? So secret, unless you're literally pointing into it, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Alright, the fact is, we should. Hmm. Where would the, would the, where would the brain deads over here keep the fucking. When you have eliminated the impossible, whatever remains, however improbable, must be the truth. You want me to go up the chimney? Like Santa Claus after he's eaten up all the biscuits? Didn't you read the plans? There's a secret passage and a hatch. Hmm, I know the recording is 
juncture for that. You know what? Why don't you just take your fat asses and just ditch them in there? Yeah, I guess that would that couldn't work. Time was I could carry a pack like this and not think twice about it. Jerky. How on earth did he get to be Uncle Jack? Everybody likes him, except you. Have they forgotten what he did? People are forgetting a lot of things now. Oh, I suppose they don't even know what he did to you. But how did they forget who it was on the German radio every night during the occupation? They locked him up after the victory. People don't talk about the past anymore. When did they let him out? You've forgotten things too, you know. down the flower pot and took us took a nap. She knew it now. Keep the fucking fat extinguisher here. I'm here in the fucking jubilators. Vomit in the fire? I guess. Clockwork uh, orange uh, reference in the background uh, here. The gas mask. Alright, the electric shack locker. Jimmy Bar, lock pick, repair kit, short spike. Yeah. The blue Molotov only sets fire, doesn't extinguish fire. Unless you're some sort of a magician that can extinguish fire with fire. Good luck with that. Hmm. 
Fuck me, I'm dumb. There was a hatch here. I hope it really does go to the tunnel to Apple Home. What different would make it Apple Home, eh? Oh dear. It is Apple Home. We haven't been in the parade in a while, have we, Margaret? I hope the executive committee listens. I hope they're willing to tell people the truth. Don't forget to get some hydrogen for your float. In case it doesn't go well in the broadcast tower. I hope you're wrong, Margaret. Boom. How the hell does all this work? So, that's not how you do it. I think you should stick to what you know. Tell me something I don't know. The rat. Uh, bigger banger, I guess. More uses for that than anything else, I'd say. That was this one. Incendiary bombs. Because why not? And a music box, because why not? What else we got? A water filter, lighting rod, an empty torch. What make an empty torch? I don't know, don't ask me. Don't know if I have one, so I might just go ahead and do one. That's for good measures. Healing bomb. A while, but it's important, I'd say. Oh, it is important. Lock pick. Hmm, you know about the water filter, though. At least you know one of them. Yeah. Bugger. Oh, whatever. Alright. What happened here? You better stay away from him. He's about to go. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> Still, you bastard. But how? I'm expecting a zombie outbreak on the other side. I think it could be on the other end, eh? If your zombie plague rolls right over here. Inside. Flash, enjoy pills, cause why not? And again, I mean, these were like those, uh, those uh, models that were all in the press now, weren't they? Actually, yeah, they were. And I was asking me for the, the drugs back then and everything, and then. They, they kind of chew down the wrong kind of mushroom, eh? 
Hey, don't get me wrong, mushrooms are good. They have a lot of vitamin D. And it's pretty healthy for you. Go on, be fabulous. Yeah, I'll be fabulous and have to survive the zombie apocalypse on the other side. Fuck it. Playhouse. What are you doing in my playhouse? Margaret. Uh, I was, uh, uh, it was raining. Your legs are all wet. They shot you. You ran and they shot you. You're still drunk. Are you going to haunt me? Do you want me to go away? No, no, please don't. I think you're sitting on Helga. Sorry, Helga. I almost finished her. She's ever so upset about her apron. She likes everything to be just so. <laughs> Could you finish her for me? She ran. Shut up. Stupid bot. Oh, look at all the pretty clothes. Look at all the ugly zombies outside. How about that? Don't worry about you know the pretty clothes at some other point when I actually sleep and everything. Survival is top one priority. Ben! Can't! Oh! Stone. So much zombies. Say! They are morning! Oh my monster! What are you? I told him he'll get a share of the profits, and he bought it. <laughs> Do you remember when we used to swim in the river? I don't. Yeah. Special means it's just, you know, just keep on talking ever so happily. the zombies. Yeah. Well, fuck it. Oh. Yeah. Fuck did he go? You never liked me, did you? Few less zombies to worry about. The parade. Hey, Holy, look out! He's about to start fighting people! <laughs> Let this be a lesson to you then. Another bloody document control. How much we learned from the Germans. I wonder who you'd be now if you'd lived. The gate's open, Ollie. Looks like a big a number on this. Right. 
own wee bonnet bun. No, I can't just not look at the telly. They put one in every bloody corner. I'll tell you what I can do. I can blow up the bloody broadcast antenna at City Hall. That is the worst idea I've ever heard from you. What do you know? You're dead. Huh? I haven't got an answer for that, have you? Margaret. Margaret. Ah. Well, speak of the devil. We all get what's coming to us in the end. I do. Communist. You can imagine yourself in 1984 with yeah. machines fucking in your house, right now. Uh, that'll make your life happy, won't it? And you're also having skills. Communist, Democrat, liberal, you fucking leftist, you're all the same. Mmm, Steve Wellington, delicious. Now the inventors at the Department of Scientific and Industrial Research have all sorts of amazing things in store. You have typewriters that type the words for you as you say them. And Ah, the Department of Senseless Idiotic Research. Hmm. In the phone booth. Yes, there'll be a built-in record player. Just bring your favorite records along when you go for a spin in your flying car. And of course, we always have our joy. We couldn't do without that, could we? We won't change a bit. It's perfect. Just in your house. What do I think about it? Is that house here? Eh. If you found a book, and the first part was everything that ever happened to you, would you keep reading? Yeah, why not? <sighs> why the hell not? If anywhere's got hydrogen, it's these bam pots. If not, I'm off to the executive committee to fill a bag with hot fucking air. I knew it was supposed to be. 
supposed to go pop. Where did they keep their hydrogen, do you think? Sin nay more. Well, I guess we'll meet in hell. my hydrogen. Now, I just need to walk out the door and... We have an intruder! I'm shutting all the doors! Oh, for fuck's sake! How do I get out now? <laughs> Bring me back! 
takes it out of your shoulders. Go on then. Oh fuck. What did I just inject on me? from the office. Well, how the hell do I do that? I can't fly up there, can I? Oh, wait, the cannon. Oh, God. Please don't use the cannon. I'm so shocked up to this. <laughs> Just need to make sure it's facing the tower and wind it up. That's a terrible idea. Just get in. I hope this doesn't tear off any bits you'll miss later. Huh. Why did you mention that before? Still got all my bits. They just hurt extraordinarily much. Who needs trains and planes? We ought to have sent the mail by cannon. All right, all right. I I've opened the door. Now please, just go. Thank you kindly. I'm going to have the worst headache for the rest of the week. Who are you? Can't be that far from here. I wonder what the executive committee is up to right now. Do that, hmm? You're getting on my nerves. You know what I could do to you right now? Much better. Now we can talk. Yeah. <coughs> Sorry about the beard. I think about your bullshit. It's the 
where do you go, you fucking cow? I hope you fucking drown. <laughs> uh oh. Vengeance is mine! Me out of everyone. Right! Oh, I'm down for me! Shoulders. such a thing as an original sin. Sorry, I had to see that. Leaving next in the curtain over there could actually just, uh, hmm, how can I say, just remain in fucking place. No, we're going to bed now. Now, how the hell am I going to get through here? Oh, the little NPC, no, that was supposed to be a little bit of a door, but no. Maybe we should just go home and stay there. <laughs> oh, doggy bought some. Doggy bought a, a friend. No plague zombies, please, no plague zombies. Amazing if there would be no plague zombies so I can actually move on forward. I have no 
not, then who cares, right? Got him easy. Uh. The elevators must be up these USA stairs. In Wellington Wells. The weather is a bit wet. But that's the lovely thing about English weather. The sun always comes out in the end. So come on out, or you'll miss it. Oh, look fun, all right. Ooh, I don't think I want to try to get past headmistress while she's on the job. I better shut her down first. Where have they hidden her controls? I need to get upstairs to see the executive committee. They're busy too, I should think. Why don't you ask somebody else? Sorry, ma'am. I need to get upstairs. You'll have to ask someone who has time on her hands. Yeah, yeah, you got plenty of time on your hands, all right. Please step away immediately. Please step away immediately. Freaky thing. You are not authorized. Please clear the area immediately. You don't know that I'm here. Just back off. You are not authorized. Please clear the area immediately. You are not authorized. Please clear the area immediately. Yeah. What about now, huh? What are you gonna do, you big fucking android? I'm not finding it. Callie, hey. 
I'm supposed to fix it, but no one seems to know where it is. Right, Joe. Oh. There. Here's what I think about your bullshit. Happy than the brown. Where do I turn on the bloody power to the elevator? Fire at it with you! Did I get here? Did you go and see Sally Boyle? I can't have. She, she's in the village. Or she came to you. It doesn't matter. She comes by. Why, why does she come by? Do we trade? What did you buy from her? Oh, my memory's more than usually fuzzy. Did you take something she gave you? I was... I was sad, wasn't I? I and, and ashamed. I can still feel it. I just don't know why. You bought something from her. Didn't you? Why was I sad? What have I got to be ashamed of? Margaret, don't look at me like that. Can't help it if I don't remember. Joy. That's what he got. Now guys, if you look close to range before the turrets start kicking in. That's what they're going to be. Say, good night! Put that black stuff on! Just shut it. Could you open it? I'm so sorry. I'm in a bit of a jam. Would you mind asking one of my colleagues? Feel the truth. Are you ready? Once you go through these doors, you're done with your, your adventures in Wellington Wells. The fuck happened? 
here. Mr. Kite has flown away. What the hell happened here? Food production. Good Christ, it's all going down the crapper. You don't have to talk like that. Why not? Honesty, sometimes cat is not always beautiful, you know. Hospitalized. Oh shit. Ah. charge here you're in luck it's me today we won't take the dread responsibility do i know you so there's only one of you who doesn't take joy on a day <laughs> i might have had a little the tanks in the military camp did you know they made a papier mache oh that's terrible would you like a joy have you been getting out into the village lately? People are getting a bit slim. And these charts, are we running out of food? Oh, no, don't look at the charts. They're horrible. Here, let me get you another joy. We've got our own booth. They're the executive committee. So you people are in charge of the whole shebang? That's us. Huh? Ever since the victory. What's wrong with the tanks? You know what? I've forgotten. Oh, good. Well, come back if you remember, but with any luck you won't. <laughs> Be seeing you. We have to tell people. They need to make a new executive committee. <laughs> Absolutely. If they won't heed the loony from the garden district, they're sure to hark into the dead girl in his head. They'd listen to Uncle Jack. You know what that man did. Everyone listens to him. All day long. I can't stand his smirking face. Ollie. You're right. You're always right, but it's not going to be pretty. If we go upstairs, we're going to make him tell the truth about bloody everything. Well, imagine my shock. Fuck it. Break the fucking. I mean, just break the fucking glass doors. You're fucking amazing. Hello! You! Hello! Here's Ollie! Hello! Time to pay the piper, Jack. Gone off. I've got things to tell you, Jack. It's all the 
played by Bloop. It's his last show. How'd you ken that? The, the camera's smashed. They couldn't have shot another. Play it. All right. No! I can't leave here until everyone knows the truth. Alright, alright then. I'm just poking around seeing how how everything works and everything. Here Let's see nothing. what Jack has to say for himself. Hmm. I'm sure I had it right here. Do you know, there are times you can actually take a little too much joy and, um, well, then you can't remember where anything is, can you? Ah, yes. Hmm. Here it is. Um, Mrs. Florence Gilbert of Brougham Hayes is holding an exhibition of her hand-knit dolls. Huh. She likes to make dolls from all over the world, all knitted in wool. It's his last it's show. Like How would you ken that? Smashed the camera's doll. smashed. They couldn't have shot another. Do you know who would have liked that? Margaret, yeah. Why is he talking about you? Who's Margaret? Because hmm? I love dolls. <laughs> what am I talking about? Who cares about the past? Well, listen, do drop by to Dee Dee's fabulous dolls at Mrs. Florence Gilbert's. Poor thing. Poor thing? She loved dolls, you know. She had dozens of them from all over. I can assure you that there's absolutely no truth to the silly rumor that the food is running out. How does he know about your dolls? However, it is true that there's a brand new flavour of joy. You think a twelve year daughter will be over dolls? His daughter? Yes, Ollie. But she'd make these darling little costumes. I knew it was wrong. I mean. God, she was even excited about going to Germany. Hmm. It was me. Couldn't imagine living without him, so. So I hid her. Someone tipped them off. And she ran. No, that's not right. It was Jack what turned you in, and I what tried to save you. No, Ollie, you turned me in. I'm afraid we've come to the end of our time. But you were my daughter. Jack Worthing. Margaret I mean it. Worthing. You're Ollie Starkey. No, I couldn't have. I could never have betrayed you. You're my neighbour. I was your neighbour. How could I? How could I do a thing like that to a little girl? Dear God. Dear God, I'm sorry, Margaret. I never meant to hurt you. It's a bit late for an apology. What, what can I do? Tell me. Do you hear me? We've come to the end of our time. The food's run out. We're all going to starve to death. You have to stop taking your joy. Take it from Jack Worthy. That's me. People have to know. But Jack's your father. Stop. That Jack's gone. That the food's run out. They all have to stop. That they have to stop. stop taking the joy. Stop it. You have to broadcast the tape. Right. Right. I could do that. But you won't, will you? God, God, I never meant to hurt you, Margaret. I'm sorry. Well then, holy shit. Told you how dark the night would be. Put on the spin, shall we? Stop going away! They've cut the power! The bastards! There's an emergency. One of those wheelie power thingy-mabobs. <sighs> You're on air! Watch out, someone's coming! Watch out, someone's coming! <laughs> Stop going on! Ow! 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 
I get damage. I'm done! Black dog! Get what's coming to us in the end. But you won't, will you? You won't. We're running out of power. I noticed. I'm afraid we've come to the end of our time. 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 We're running out of power. Yeah, I've saved. <laughs> I'm guess walking out the front door is out of the question. Good thing I made you get that float. Yeah. Could now there be an angry horde after him, yeah? What do we do now? We say goodbye. To who? I'm not really your daughter. I know that. And I'm not really here. But... I'm a lie too. We've been together so many years. You don't think having an invisible friend is a wee bit babyish for a man who's been to war? We can hide in the train station till it all blows over. Now that you've put that on the telly, I think it's time you put away childish things. Ooh. You're right. You're always right. Goodbye, Margaret. Epilogue. 
I'll be around the depression. You all right, sir? I'd forgotten just how heinous a person I am. Well, the truth is not for everyone, sir. You see, some people find they are stronger than they ever supposed. Some people can let go of the confabulations that have comforted them. Some make choices that surprise even themselves. The booze run out! You have to stop taking your joy! But perhaps these people are not you. Are you sure you don't wish to forget? And go back? I was happy I before. It's so nice. Wasn't I? Remember. Remember. Are you really a constable? I patrol the boundaries. Come on, sir. Once you're out there, you'll know what to do. Day for it. I don't even know how to tell the truth anymore. Oh, lovely day for it. Oh, are you joking? It's been shitty all day. <laughs> Did you not notice the drops of water falling out of the sky? It's gonna be shitty tonight too. You're right. It has been rather a shit day. Yeah, he's gone insane, all right. He can't, he went batshit crazy, all right. <clears throat> hmm. Out of curiosity, as well, too. Yeah, I played it really stark and everything else. Peter, PSA downer. Huh. Hold on, can I get like the uh, the very very last one of them? No, uh, definitely not. I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. Look for the next one. I'll see you guys next time in the end. I'm gonna lie, it's a really, really a lovely and amazing game. Oh yeah. I'll see you guys next time and until then.